Uh, well, Sarah, first of all, big uh, commiserations. Uh, you know, she, she was a, a very strong fighter, as we expected her to be, and she just got you with that hip on there. You, you were so close, though. Yeah, it was a really close fight. Um, it is quite difficult because she's obviously my training partner as well at the club I train at. Um, so we both knew each other quite well. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, as, as nice as it would have been to get a medal, I'm just really pleased to be able to represent the army at this level and get to a medal contest at the Commonwealth Games and, and hopefully do us proud. I mean, what's it been like actually being part of this and competing? Because it's a very, as you say, it's a very special thing to do, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, as I said, the special thing about it for me is getting to represent Northern Ireland, which I don't normally get to do because whenever I compete internationally, it's for Great Britain. So to actually get to represent Northern Ireland is a really special thing. And the Games is really special because, you, you know, you're in that sporting environment 24-7, you know, within the village and there's all the athletes and events going on. It's just a really great environment to be in. We can see you were really pumped up for that one. You know, when you came out and obviously the, the support that you had and the, and the, the crowd cheering. I mean, that, that's a very special feeling and it's something I'm sure you'll never forget. Oh, an amazing feeling. You know, there's nothing else like it in the world. Um, yeah, I mean, it's just, it, it's a mixture of emotions whenever you step out there because there's obviously the feeling of pressure because the environment you're in, you know, the lights, the music, just one map being watched, you know, and the crowd. But it's also nice whenever you have the home crowd cheering you on and everything as well. So it's a, a real bag of emotions going out there, really. And at the end of the day, you know, after all the training you've done, you gave it your very, very best, the best you possibly could out there. And no one could ever ask any more than that. Well, that's it. I mean, the, the thing with sport, you know, with any sport really, is all you can do is go out and give your best. And, you know, you, no one can predict what's actually going to happen on the day. You know, it could go your way or it mightn't go your way you don't know until the actual day happens, you know, and that's what's great about sport is everybody's in with a chance and it's just great to get out there and give it everything you have. Well, I know everyone in the British forces, the British Army, Royal Military Police and in Northern Ireland will be so proud of what you've achieved. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well done.